Daniel Medvedev versus Andre Rublev is the third quarter final for the Men's US Open for 2023. And both players have fought to get to this stage. Rublev entered the tournament as the number eight seed and will take on Kazoo in the first round. But this was no problem getting through in straights. 6-4, 7-6, 6-1. In the second round, he'd take on Monfils. And after dropping the third set, would run away with it. 6-4, 6-3, 3-6, 6-1. In the third round, he'd take on Rindanish, who had just beaten Berrettini the previous round. And after dropping the first set, Rublev would fight back to win. 3-6, 6-3, 6-1, 7-5. In the fourth round, he'd take on Jack Draper, who was having sort of a resurgence this week. And after splitting the first two sets, Rublev would eventually get through in four, 6-3, 3-6, 6-3, 6-4, to advance to another quarterfinal of a slam. Medvedev entered the tournament as the number three seed and would take on Balash in the first round. This is no problem getting through in straights, 6-1, 6-1, 6-love. In the second round, he'd take on O'Connell, and after dropping the third set, would run away with it in the fourth, 6-2, 6-2, 6-7, 6-2. In the third round, he'd take on Baez, and after a close third set, Medvedev would get through in straights. 6-2, 6-2, 7-6. In the fourth round, he'd take on Demonor, a man he'd lost to the two previous meetings, including one a couple of weeks ago in Canada. And after dropping the first set, Medvedev would fight back to win 2-6, 6-4, 6-1, 6-2 to advance to the quarterfinals. These two have played seven times before, with Medvedev leading the head-to-head 5-2, but Rublev has won two of their last three matches, including an epic match at the end of last year in the ATP Finals. However, Medvedev did win their only meeting this year pretty convincingly. If Rublev's going to win this one, he needs to keep his head as he always needs to in these matches, but also he needs to play well on the ground strokes. Try and move Medvedev around and also use variety. We've seen so many players pick Medvedev off at the net. And Diminor did that really well in the first set. Unfortunately, couldn't keep it going. So Rublev can volley. He's got to come to the net and use that to his advantage. If Medvedev's going to win this one, he needs to serve well and play well on the ground strokes and really drag these rallies out. He actually did really well against Diminor once the first set was over from the baseline. Just going baseline to baseline, dragging the rallies out, 30 shot rallies. That's how he's going to frustrate Rublev into maybe hitting errors. Such a fun matchup. These guys are good friends. They've played for so long. They've probably played more matches than just this ATP as well. Juniors as well, but I've got to go with Medvedev in this one. I feel like beating Medvedev at a slam for Rublev might be one too many. And he has made the quarterfinals a lot. I don't know if the semifinals are there for him this year. I feel like Medvedev in four, but let me know down in the comments below who's making the semifinals.